What's up, Mets fans? Welcome to a new episode of the Teens of Queens podcast. Today we have a pretty fun segment that we're doing. Um, we're kind of doing, each of us are saying what we wish the Mets would have got for the holiday season, like a player they would have acquired or, you know, a move that they would have made. Um, so I think it'd be a pretty cool segment to kind of get interactive here. So who wants to start first? I'll go first. So, um... For my gift, I would have liked to get got um George Springer. Um, the Mets are rumored uh to be one of the last teams uh in on him with the Blue Jays, and the guy's just a generational talent. Um, we need a center fielder, considering Brandon Nimmo is he's he's just not good enough in center field to play there every day. I think he's very much adequate to play left field he's a his bat needs to stay in the lineup but I just don't think he's good enough to play center field um George Springer would slot right up into the top of that order be a big power bat his numbers have been great the past few years um he's he's experienced winning culture in Houston been a great playoff player and I, I, he's from the Northeast, so I'm sure he wants to come home. It would probably take around five years, 25 to $30 million a year to get him. But this is a guy that is, he's a winning player, and I think he'd really make the Mets a great team. He'd really help out our offense. And I, I hope we can get George Springer within the next few weeks to months. Tim, who would your uh, gift this holiday season be if you uh, had an option? Um, I would have to say my, if I were to receive a gift for the holiday season, it would have to be Trevor Bauer. Trevor Bauer would fit perfectly in our already elite rotation. We obviously need a, a starting pitcher in that rotation. We're missing a, we're missing a, someone in that spot. We have uh, Jacob deGrom, Noah Syndergaard, Stroman, Peterson, we need someone else to fill that spot. And who, who else would be better than Cy Young 2020 winner, Trevor Bauer? He has a great personality. It fit great in New York. He He's expressed that the Mets are on the top of his list in multiple videos he's made on his YouTube channel. Um, he's very interactive. I think he'd fit great with the, the Mets roster they have right now. Um, it'd be a little pricey. Um, he already said he, he is not looking for a one-year deal. That report just came out the other day. Um, so we'd probably have to get him on a decent contract, um, but it's worth it. He's coming off a Cy Young year. Um, he's, he's proved to many baseball fans he's improved on his game. His spinner has been through the roof better than it has been in the past. And overall, he's just been a he's been a top pitcher in MLB. He's proving to become one of the great, uh, best pitchers of our time right now. Um, so I think Trevor Bauer would be a, a great addition to this um, already great rotation we have right now. I think George Springer would be a great uh, addition, but I think Nimmo could, could is fine. Um, he, he's obviously not the greatest center field, but I think uh, it's more of a want than need, but we need to fill this fifth spot in, in the rotation. And just think about this playoff rotation. We have DeGrom going game one, Bauer game two, Syndergaard three, Stroman four. That, that's There's – Unless the offense just doesn't show up, that that that's like an automatic win. We, we have a we, we'd be great in the playoffs. Trevor Tra Bauer is uh, he wants to be a winner. He wants to be in the playoff atmosphere. He wants to be in the uh, spotlight. And there's no better place to be that in than New York. So um, I think that Trevor Bauer would be a great fit in New York, and hopefully we can get that done very soon. So um. That's why I think Trevor Bauer would be a great, and that's why I wish we would have signed him over the holidays, and we still can. So that's that was who I would wish for the holiday season. And what we'll, what would be uh, your Christmas uh, deal present for the holidays, Bubba? Well, you see here, you know, these two presents or these two gifts that these guys just mentioned, absolutely great, in my opinion. Um, I would love both of them, um, and I think – all you guys out there would love both of them too. It may not be re realistic to get both of them, but one of them would just be great. Um, you know, all three of our accounts have been mentioned that everybody wants, you know, Springer or Bauer. Um, 
everybody's asking, oh, when the Mets are going to shine Springer or Bauer, and we know, we know. It's a very slow off season, so it's pretty obvious that, you know, nothing's going to get done um, that early on. But as we're moving closer to the start of the season, um, getting to January, I think we might be close to resolution on where these top tier free agents are going to sign. So, with my gift, has to be a Michael Conforto extension. I mean, ever since Conforto was called up to the major leagues, he's been my favorite player, or at least top three of my favorite player. Um, I just think since, you know, the two home run game that he had as a rookie in the World Series in 2015, um, so the Mets lost that um, series. But, but, you know, I think uh, locking up Conforto long-term and keeping him in, with the Mets – would definitely be at the top of my list as, you know, like I say, he's been one of my favorite players, great player, great guy, great role model for the team. Um, he, without being named, he's probably one of like the team captains, you could probably say, without even being named it. But, um, you know, like, I love Michael Conforto. I think he'd be, you know, really nice to have extended being with the Mets, hopefully for the rest of his career. And uh, hopefully the Mets could get something done with him. So that would definitely be on my wish list for a gift to the Mets. Yeah, so those were those would be three great Christmas gifts or holiday gifts, depending on what you celebrate. Um, but yeah, so I believe any of those would be great, and all any of them would be accepted by Mets fans. And so I think um, uh, those are. And who knows? Some of those we can get uh, multiple of these things done because Steve Cohen's got the money to do this stuff. We have about sixty million till we reach the luxury tax, so maybe we see two of these guys. Or two of these things happen, whether that's signing Bauer and Springer or maybe giving Comporta an extension and signing ba- Bauer or whatever, whatever combination you want to do. I think it's possible. George sends one way out of here. Springer way up on the train tracks. The Ford train has just left Union Station with a um, those could definitely happen, but pinch run situation. That ball's crushed to left field, and that is over the head. But, uh, I'll definitely keep an eye on those two. Those are very two interesting players we could go after, but I think that's overall the, the market the Mets have right now and the possibility. So, so I believe that is all the time we have for today's episode. I hope you guys had a very great holiday season, and yes. I wish you guys a very, very safe uh, holiday season and a happy new year. So. See you guys later, and let's go Mets.